Okay. There is a trainer in the water. I'm just gonna outright assume um, that she is a water temtem tamer. You fight me now, please. You must be that denizen that never washes. Yeah, that's me. What? Of course I wash. Do you know? Uh, do you know? You're always on the surfboard, but nobody has... Oh, is that meant to be do you now? You're always on that surfboard, but nobody has ever seen you take a bath. I have a rare skin condition. I felt I feel self-conscious about bathing in public. If only hours are such hours. I'll do the second one. Lame excuses. You could take a bath right here, but look at you, avoiding the water like a skittish mulgu. I demand, <laughs> I demand redress for that offence. <laughs> you think you're in some sort of period movie? That might explain the lack of hygiene. What? What? That's really rude. Ba -da -da -da. Right, strangle her. DC beam her. You've been strangled. You can't move. When was the last time you bathed in this game? Probably never. Disgusting. I am disgusting. How you doing, Joe? <laughs> right. DC beam it again. Take that. We're in a movie about period now. Hey, Calibus is 50. Our first 50. Oof. The stink is so distracting. Be gone. No, you'll be gone, filthy lady. She swam all the way over there in that short time. Jesus Christ, she's fast. Oh, I don't have my skates any. Hello. Hey, friend. Thanks for playing with Aelany. She can be a bit insistent when she's bored. My pleasure. Your daughter, Temtem up? Mm, yeah, but I need to keep an eye on her. If she runs onto the crystal patch without skates again, breaks a leg, her mother will kill me. Again? How many times has this happened? Hey, a man of culture with a calibus. Right, we can just DC beam it. Ooh, you strong. Haha, <laughs> you poison. Nom nom nom. Why are you poisoning me? I'll bite. I will. I'll bite. Nom nom nom. I'm gonna chain beam DC face you words. Why you punch me? Ordered time. No, not the sleep punch. Does Pokemon have a sleep punch? I don't think it does. It has a punch that confuses people. Dizzy punch. They should make one called slumber punch. Right, um, so they have a water type and... Do I have a mind user? I don't think I do. You have Blizzard. Um... I can't change moves, but you did have Crystal Dust and I removed it. Okay, let's get you out. Mirror match! Right, Aqua Stone him, Fierce Claw him. Uh oh. We're getting in a spirited Calibus tank, please. Thank you. Aqua Stone. You're both exerted now as well, which is awesome. No longer alerted. Mind you, my Calibus isn't looking. You know what? Just strangle that one. Yeah, we got them both. Those two are tough cookies. Ooh, it survived. Right, Calibus, I need you to rest. Scunch leveled. Okay, you rest. Pierce claw him one last time.
That was entertaining, friend. I hope Aelani enjoyed the spectacle too. Meanwhile, she's broken her leg on the ice again, or the crystal or whatever. Can't believe I lost my crystal skates. I'm guessing that's her up there? Oh god, I gotta use the D-pad. You can't use the uh, thumbsticks for this for some reason. It gets really weird. I suppose they both end in the same place, don't they? How about up here? Where does this one go? Bump, bump, bump. And then... No, we're about to go around the circle. No, not a circle! Bum, bum, bum. Right, let's go back out this way. So what if I go to this one? Oh, they both go to the same one anyway, won't they? Oh, wait. Go up and then... Nah, nah, nope. That's the same place as earlier, Tim. Brain no work! Um... Okay, let's try a bottom path. Where am I going? That's quite a travel. Aha! There we go. Found it. We can get to this thing. Hmm? Ah, hello. Sorry. I suppose you're one of those tamers from the dojo. Looking for someone to fight and hone your skills on. I worry I might not be a good opponent today. Let's fight all the same. Right, I can see you don't really care about my feelings. Okay, let's fight and then you'll leave me alone, please. I just want that chest. Cool afro, grandma. <gasps> it's my first time seeing both of these. They're both cool. I like them both. Oh, really? What is that rhino's typing? I'm guessing ground and... I don't know. I'm going to just say it's solo ground. That's that's going to be my guess. That thing's definitely ground fighting at the top. It has to be. Let's see what these do. They're both level 15. Ooh, times two. Nice. Don't worry, Volcrane. Just buy Calib this time and we'll win. Where's my bunny? There's my bunny. It's so cute, I love it. Okay. I'm gonna aqua stone the other one and just test. And we are gonna sand splatter that other one. Boom! Need to se Oh god, that was times four. Sorry, bun bun! Uh oh. Ooh, half, okay. That one's overexerted, so I can get away with attacking the other one this turn. Where's Lawali? I'm gonna use Nimble on Calibus, get its speed up. And Calibus can go ahead and attack the other one. I do have to be careful though. Before I overexert myself. We might have to use a bomb plus. Actually, I'll use a tonic. Then we can get some energy and HP back. Although, actually, to be fair... No, just use it. You can blizzard him. Rolder. Hey, Luwali got a level. Wicked. I should have practiced more. Yes, you should. I might actually try to breed a perfect Luwali. They just seem like such good support, Temtem. A wild Temtem here? <gasps> it's these two adorable ones. Hey dragons, how are you? Right, I'm going to use Water Blade on you, because it's not super effective. I'm going to face cry you. Aw, oh, shit. I wanted to catch them both. Aw. Cold, so cold. Aw. Get a blankie and a hot chucky. Those are always perfect combos for the winter. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> I've been drinking a lot of hot chocolates at the moment. It's actually disgraceful. 
how many I've had. Not today. Last night, I think I had three. I had a cup of tea followed by three hot chocolates. Just, it's the season for warm drinks. Hot drinks never warm you up. Aw. How shall we? Have you tried bathing? No, don't do that. <laughs> Release. It's not got one perfect lesson. Just fill a bath up with hot chocolate. Yay! Growth enhancers. Ooh, it was worth coming this way. I might smoke bomb. Just so we can go and heal up. I need to go to the Tem Tem Center, I think. I need to get there somehow. Let's just have a look. No, there's nothing to stop me to get there, is there? I'm guessing I need the skates to go that far. That's probably just a shortcut back for now until we get our skates back. Bathing with no hot water. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, what? You don't have hot water at the moment? I don't know how that feels. It's horrible. Am I stuck here for eternity? I'm guessing yes. What Temtem do we have left alive? We've used our vial. Move you to the top. You know what, Scunch? I'm going to put you at the front for now. And we are going to do the YMCA. Um, where's the burba burba? I heard a cute Temtem. I want it. I don't even know what it was, but I want it. Okay, we got bar. I'm not going to use the plus pluses yet. I need to buy some revives and stuff. If the heating hasn't been on, there's been no hot water. <gasps> you need a fire type Pokemon like a Flareon in your house. Can Bell Soto what? Pre orders? Can Bell Soto pre orders? You mean prevails? Why are you dressed like that? Clan Bell Soto rules. They're stone cold gangsters. Cool as heck. Gangsters aren't cool. They're fucking pathetic, mate. They're a bunch of thugs. They're just as dumb as you. They do cool stuff and nobody can stop them. I want to be like that. Oh. You're so ironic and edgy. Glad you got it eventually, but for real, I can fight like a true Bel Soto. I've been training. Look here. Oh dear. He's one of those. The kid plays Grand Theft for five minutes and thinks he's a gangster. Right, let's do Fizz Claw on the, the poop face. Okay. I'm gonna nimble you as well. Oh, you're already the fastest thing alive. My bad. Yeah. Speed up. Yikes. Stop slapping me. That's rude. You know what? Put it to sleep. And you... Can... Oh, Blizzard doesn't even affect you that well. Yikes, then. Um, I'll screw it. Put that one to sleep. Oh. Shit, sleep immunity. No! There goes my plan. It's been foiled. Scunch, are you okay? Nice damage. Sigh, Surge. Sorry, Scunch. I was very bad at predicting all of this. Worst tamer on the planet is me. Come out, Calibus. Right, just water blade that one. What does this one do again? Nature Temtem are unique and blah blah blah. Okay, now we're just bark shield scrap. Calibus, no! Yeah, you better almost kill yourself. There we go. Get out of here, Banshu. Our defense is up. Ukama, which one's this? Oh, it's the other water one. Okay, we're, we're good. We're good. Um, hmm. 
I think I'm gonna strangle Herania. No, strangle the new boy. We'll finish the other one off. Haha, <laughs> didn't do much. Enjoy the poison. I shouldn't have blizzarded you. I should have let you get poisoned to death. There we go. Bye bye. <laughs> right, you can rest this turn. And you can rest this turn. He has to as well because we strangled him. It's always weird saying that. Mm, just nimble. I was going to photosynthesis, but let's go all out. <laughs> that resistance is yum. Decent damage. And strangled again. Photosynthesis! I damaged myself to do that? Yikes. Oh well. Hang on, Elawali. Right, he's overexerted this turn. Wicked. Now oh, we can Blizzard again. Bio Karma. And we should probably go back and heal our Temtem because our Tem Essence Bile is also damaged. Ouch, or damaged used up rather. I think it would be cool on this game if like at certain milestones, bye loser. <laughs> if at certain milestones in this game your Tem Essence file got upgrades that allowed you to use them more like a certain amount of times. Or if you got like a certain amount of Tem Essence vials, like you got a second one at the end of this, like every other island or something, so island one, three, five, blah, blah, blah. You got another one. I don't know. I'm just blabbing at this point. Right, whereabouts is the Tem Center? It's down there. Why don't I just press B after doing that every single time? I wonder if they're going to the center. Nope, but we followed the motion away anyway. Right, let's heal. Or turn our back to the machine. That's one way to heal, I guess. Just ignore the healing machine. Welcome back. Okay. Uh, we can probably do it with some more smoky bombs. Don't really care about sense. Let's get the rest of our Temtem cards back. Um, I'll buy some more bomb pluses. Screw it. We get some normal bombs for out of combat as well. I want my pansons to be constantly consumed while we're playing through. I don't want to accidentally lose any to NPCs. It'd be kind of pointless. I can't remember where Mankey is. I don't know if they like live on this route or whatever, but I'm going to keep pushing this route. Mainly because I don't remember doing this route last time I ever played this game. This route might not have existed back. I don't even remember if I'm honest. But there seems to be some very strong tamers here, which is nom. What was down? We never went down last time. Oh, it's the same route. There's that Belsotto gangster nerd norb neighbor da person. Nerbadar. I guess we can't go out this way, huh? Gosh darn. Okay. Uh, maybe there was another way this way then. No? Maybe not? Huh. No, that just leads back there. I think we need the skates for here. It doesn't actually lead anywhere anyway. Okay, now let's just go back then. I'm sure we just need to finish our journey in the town. I will return here when we get our skates back though. That is a plummies.
Do, do, do. Wait. Look at that agabulb. Isn't it magnificent? Incredible. How strong they grow down here. You mean that pink tree? Yes, of course. What else could... Oh, you're from out of town. I see. Apologies. That explains it. Yes, that's an agabulb. An interesting hybrid tree bulb. I'm a bit of an amateur botanist and I love agabulbs. I could talk about them all day. So this is your warning before I start giving you the whole encyclopedia entry on them. <laughs> Shut up, man. Well, no need to be rude. You know what? I think you need to be taught a lesson. Tem tem hum. <laughs> Shut up. Just battle me. Skunch and Lawali. Okay. I want you to beat that one up. And we're gonna make you zoom. You're already zoom. Never mind. Oh, it's gonna kill Skunch, huh? Well, I guess we're going to accidentally nimble one of them. No, good. Rude. Where's Kazuma? Kazuma would do really well here, actually. Right, chain lightning Kazuma! That should hurt them both. Uh, we will also use Nimble on Kazuma. Hey, no. Rude. You tried. Faster, Kazuma, faster. <laughs> Do it again. But this time we're getting Bark Shield. Sorry, Lowali, I know that must have hurt. Not Venomous Claws! God damn it. Hey, it's overexerted though. Um, bum bum. Let's get Bulk Rain out. Right. Mush hook. Okay, there's a grass one. Gotcha. Time to burn that bad boy. Um, Kazuma, you're pretty eeked. Pretty eeked. Eh, Psypat's dead at least. Whack, whack. No water on our rock. Fire thing. Burn him. Ooh, not super effective, huh? Hmm. I wonder. That thing's part fighting, right? Yikes. So have a nice burn. Hmm. I want to try this typing. I want to see if the ground typing actually affects, um... Oh, never mind, we dead. <laughs> that was pointless. Get back out here, Kazuma, I'm an idiot. Okay, just drill impact, it would be fine. Wow, you resistant. And there's whole crane gone. Uh-oh. And my two favourites are out in the field again. Actually, just strangle it. I think Drill Impact should finish it anyway. Yeah. Nice. Nice Temming. We should have a glass of Quetzalino Rep... What? Reposado? To celebrate, I I don't know what any of those words mean. Push down this way. Oh, there is nothing down this way. Oh, we got the chest there at the start. Herder. Right, let's go back up. Ding dong. To the Temessent Center, and then we're gonna look for um, was it Mankey we're looking for? I think it was Mankey. Get our jumping lessons on. Or what was it? Down and left for the 10 mess? Yeah. 
I don't know what that route's meant to be, but at least in future when we get our crystal skates back, we can now go there and, uh, yeah, have some fun. It's kind of a pain in the arse that we lost our crystal skates, not gonna lie. I wonder when we actually get them back. I do wonder. Right. I forgot what Mankey's house even was. Um... Mind you, I think I had the house right the first time. Let's just go in and talk to Thingy my fish on the bed. Mm -hmm. Be careful on the Capeleza. The Capeleza? I think that's it. And best of luck to imbued. I hope you find what you're looking for in Kisiwa. Nope. Unless Mankey was waiting for us outside town, where the jumpy thing was. Was it all the way this way? Ah, let's just go into everyone's house. Hello! No more guests, sorry. I've nearly finished making dinner. Aww. That's the best time for guests, and I can eat all your dinner. Nom nom nom. We'll just leave that house. Um... Oh, I can see where the bridge extends. It's this bit up here. This place is confuzzling. I don't know my way around. <clears throat> ba 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 ba. Let me out. Let's open this. Oh yeah, the quest marker's there, okay. You know what, as there is a healing center here, I am gonna heal here as well. Just in case we die, we can come back to this one. Because I am a noob, and death is most likely gonna happen multiple times today. Ah, finally. Okay, have you done this before? Uh, never. Thought so. This is a very Turkmani thing, so listen carefully. Rock hopping is the ancient art and sport of skipping from one floating rock or islet to the other, using the special rock hoop, uh, hopping hook. Uh, it's made of interroreed, interroreed, which you have probably seen around Tukma. Don't worry, it's very flexible and resistant. Use it properly and it will let you rock hop safely for years. So, these are the basics. You find a proper spot for rock hopping, like this one here. Then you aim your rock hopping hook carefully, take a leap and zoom! You should shoot your hook at the right moment. If you time it right, you should be able to nail it to the other side with the rock hopping hook. And the retractile in terror read will do the rest, pulling you safely to the other side. And if I time it wrong, that's what those safety nets are for. I mean, they're in this area for novices. Once you rock hop far enough, there will be nothing breaking your fall you miss, uh, if you miss. So make sure you are proficient before you move on. Got it. Sure about that? Okay, let me see you practice. Take this and try your first hop here. There we go.